Sean Ashton, Ryan Botha. Okay, <laughs> if you want it that way. We are at the Orlando Towers and we're about to bungee jump. So, you know, white people do this on their weekends. So, for us, this is a once in a lifetime experience. We'll see how it goes. Tell the story about what, what white guys do on the weekend. So the white people we'll have the wonderful we'll weekends. <laughs> you guys will start. Hey, what, what, what do you tell the guys do? Now we, we just take out the barbecue, you know, <laughs> Mondays back to the... <laughs> My name's Vaughan. I'm the Chief Jump Master here, as well as the Operations Coordinator. And uh, this is pretty much the site where we throw people off for fun. Well, we're actually very amped at the, today. We're having uh, Morocco Swallows coming through, a couple of the players coming through. So uh, we're going to see how football boys handle a bit of height and uh, see if they can handle a bit of extreme activities, definitely. I'm Sue, I'm the marketing manager here at Orlando Towers, although I'm not, I'm not always based here. We're obviously getting out into Joburg, we're getting out to the tour operators, getting out into the city, telling people about the place. This was the dream of Bob Woods. He's an industrial rope access specialist, and his company was retained to do the rope work when these towers were first painted. You know, you've got the spectacular FNB mural on the towers. And he had such fun here, he decided his last vision would be to have an, a vertical entertainment center where people could come and climb, abseil, jump, and enjoy the spectacular beauty of these towers. They really are inspiring. Once you get up there, you'll see. This is Angie, Tato, Komoto, Parker, Bonks, and Lawrence. The other guys that you meet up at the top at the moment, yes, that is meant to look like that because they are busy rigging the ropes at the moment for you. Brand new ropes. So. Yeah, you'll you test them for us. So. You <laughs> As they can wear you can do foot. Okay. Okay, Ryan. Right. How much? Paka. I'm a jump master here. I'm oh, Lee, I'm a jump assistant. David, bench host. Lawrence, jump off the bench. Your brain thinks you're about to die. Yeah. You guys will experience it. It's intense, but you'll enjoy it. Ah, I can't wait. I'm looking forward to it. Feel, I need a caffeine rush for a jump. I love my coffee. I didn't have time this morning to have a cup of coffee, so there it is. Morning coffee. I thought I'd skydive before I bungee jump. Yeah, we did. I, did I like the guy. idea of a parachute instead of a plastic band connected to your leg. Next time, take me skydiving. Speaking to Angie over here, and I'm trying to, you know, just take my mind off it, so to speak. I guess I really only get scared when it when the time comes closer to actually go and do the jump so I'm not trying to think about it right now. I'm looking forward to it, I can't wait. I'm positive, I'm just focusing on what I'm going to do here. I already kissed my wife like my wife last night so I think I'll do a great job here. Like, but I'm a little bit scared but not that scared. Mixed emotions slightly. It's hard man. That's really hard. <laughs> Man of many words right there. Uh, uh, dude, it's hot. Yeah, I can see that. Football is something you know, something that's in you and something you can control. This time um, it's someone else's mercy, so that's what I don't like about it, because someone else is the expert here, you know? And when we're playing football, we're, so to speak, the pros. So this you is a control. different, you're yeah, control. yeah you're, you're in control, control, basically. This is something so, yeah, else, yeah. this is something different, totally different. This is what you're going to be jumping in. As I said, the latest of French fashion. Full body harness or a fall arrest harness. Consists of shoulder straps, waistbands, and leg loop. Okay, so everything is completely safe. Nothing around here works in kilograms. It all works in tons. Just as another pointer as well, the cable that you see up at the top of there, that is uh, the rigging point. What happens is the rope is sent from the belay station, which are the guys that, that make sure that when you swing, the rope doesn't just drop, dump you on the ground. It runs out from there all the way to the center, well, more or less the center of the cable. At that point, it then comes down. It runs through pulleys that are completely safe. We use climbing pulleys, so the pulleys are completely safe. With the rigging system itself, to date, with all the jumps we've had, only operates at about five, maybe six percent of its maximum operating capacity. Part of me is asking myself, what are doing? Beeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
part of the team's plan is to move back to Soweto, and uh, I would take this as a first initiative, you know, players jumping off in Orlando. I think it will be a good preparation before our pirate game. Yeah. To see, to see you have the ah, ah, ah. Actually, on a fast forward, see ya. They first have to attach the rope. I wish I could. This is not enough. This is not a parachute. <laughs>